I'm Jeremy with Safe Air Certified Mold Inspection, and I'm a certified microbial consultant. You can find me on the web at safeairtesting.com, or you can also call me at 404-695-0673. Uh, many people ask me what happens during a mold remediation. Um, the mold remediator cleaning the mold wears personal protective equipment so they are not exposed to mold contaminants. They wear an N95 protective mask for small projects so they do not breathe mold contaminants. They wear a full face uh, respirator for larger projects. Latex gloves are essential. Goggles, earplugs, and coverall suits are also recommended. Uh, the area where the mold remediation is taking place is sealed off with a plastic containment and placed under negative pressure with a fan exhausting air to the outdoors. These steps will prevent mold from spreading to unaffected areas during the mold remediation. Water damage and mold contaminated sheetrock and insulation is cut away and discarded. Any lumber that has been soaked in water is discarded. Lumber, cement, and any other building material that was affected by water damage and mold is scrubbed with a damp cloth and a scrub brush and a mild detergent. There will be settled indoor type mold spores on every surface inside containment, including walls, ceiling, floor, and personal contents. Uh, you will want to HEPA vacuum, then wipe every surface inside containment with a damp cloth and a mild detergent. Items that can be steam cleaned, dry cleaned, or washed in a washing machine can usually be sufficiently cleaned to remove mold containment. Spray any surfaces that were affected by water damage and mold with a chemical that sterilizes mold. Fogging inside containment with a chemical that sterilizes mold is recommended. Air filtration machines called air scrubbers operate inside containment for a few days after cleaning is complete as a final step. Air samples are collected after the mold remediation is complete to determine the success of cleaning activity. I recommend spraying an antimicrobial encapsulant such as FiberLock on lumber after it has passed testing and inspection. FiberLock discourages mold from returning to surfaces it has been applied to. I recommend RMR brand chemicals for mold remediation. I think they make the best. Call Safe Air Certified Mold Inspection for your mold testing and mold inspection needs. Thank you.